Hey, what's happening guys? Luke Wayne here. Hope you guys are having a good day. And as always, remember high hopes, low expectations. Remember, like if you want to help my videos get into the YouTube algorithm. And always subscribe if you enjoy my content and want to help my channel grow. It really does help. And I check very often and I love it whenever I get a new subscriber. I appreciate it all the time. But anyways, none of that YouTuber BS clickbait. BS. Let's just get down to news. Who is this person? Why should we trust them? I will tell you guys that in a minute. But the news for today is this trustworthy per uh, person uh, said, don't be shocked if you see a Superman game within the next one to two years. Smiley face emoji. Hashtag Superman with the Superman picture from Injustice 2 in the background. Now, um, someone asked them, let's hope, or someone said that let's hope it's a proper studio doing it. I don't care about a Superman game if it's not a proper Superman game from a talented studio like Rocksteady. From what I've heard, it's being made by a proper studio. I'm not just pulling this out of thin air to get, pe to get people's hopes up, and this is very important right here. I know you definitely have heard something. But the new generation of consoles definitely makes the Superman game much more possible, and that's why it sounds too, uh, sounds too good if a proper studio is not attached to it. Yes, a Superman game can absolutely be done properly. Okay. So this person obviously knows something, but why should we trust them? Well, German, please. They are a writer for the GWW. Does that not sound familiar? Let me refresh you. Remember, if you've been following my channel, then you know all about this. Uh, best wars for geeks worldwide. Go to their website. Look at that date there. About a week, I think, if you remember me reporting on this back when it was a leak, you know, the DC fandom event uh, that DC has officially announced. But before they announced this, this was the first website, I believe, that actually leaked it. They had the right time, the right uh, everything, you know, and they also studied what will be revealed there. And since they have guessed or been told everything about this event before DC officially announced it, unless it was just an incredibly lucky guess, which is impossible with all this detail. Um, the Batman will be revealed at the event because that's what they said. But also, obviously, what I'm trying to say is that UWW has a very reliable source if they know about these um, official announcements before DC even announces them. So, when this writer for the GWW says that there's going to be a Superman game within the next one to two years, whether that it be revealed in the next one to two years or released in the next one to two years remains to be seen. But regardless, uh, when they say there's going to be a Superman game within the next one to two years, one to two years I believe them, and I think you guys should too. This is a journalist. They want to put their career on the line. Uh, if they didn't, you know, uh, have faith in this or didn't have multiple sources, and most likely it is the same sources, and there's probably going to be an article written about it soon. But she even said, or from what I've heard, maybe, I, or she, yeah, I don't know, I'm assuming she put a profile picture. Uh, from what I've heard, it's being made by a proper studio. I'm not just pulling this out of thin air to get people's hopes up. So, I think you should trust them. If you remember, I called the fake leak from a mile away that I just covered. I said it was fake, and then I proved it fake. And also, uh, that leak with the Batman trailer thing that a while ago before the PlayStation reveal event, uh, I said it was fake, and it was fake. And I'm saying this one is real, and I also said the DC fandom event was real. So I've been right about everything so far in my YouTube career, which I've only been around for a month, so it's not saying much. But still... I really trust this person, and if it's not revealed in the next one to two years, then it's either been pushed back or canceled. But I really think this person's on to something. I really think they have something. They wouldn't be putting their career on the line like this. So expect to see rumors soon because we know WB is not very uh, good with security. We get leaks all the time. But anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. That's all the news. No YouTuber clickbait BS. There's my opinion. There's the news. What do you guys think? Do you like this? Obviously, if you're this on the video, then you enjoy my content. So please subscribe. Uh, please like. Really, it does help. I appreciate every subscriber. Like, if you enjoyed, I've only been around for a month. I already have over 300 subs, so this is amazing to me. But anyways, you guys are the reason why I do this channel. 85% of the reason why I do this channel. Uh, so I love interacting with you guys. Please tell me down in the comments below what you think of this video. Did you dislike it? Leave constructive criticism because I would love to improve. Again, I tried talking a little bit slower in this video, but I do get excited, which I guess is why I do YouTube. I love it. So uh, excuse me if I my voice is a little slurred. But what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more updates on this game, the Gotham Knights slash Batman Arkham 2020, whatever you want to call it, and Rock City's supposed Suicide Squad game. Catch you guys in the next one. Stay awesome, y'all, and peace.